pixel. I don't know if you were able to go, because you uh, Drilago went straight up. I don't know if you could have gone straight right to maybe sneak through the well, blocks. Well, let's see here. If we kind of slow it down here, you know. I believe he needed to go up diagonal left, yeah. but I'm not oh, sure. Oh, he if just went straight up. Oh, actually, up. yeah. No, yeah. I think it was blocking the entire path. So Because oh, the way it works shame. is you need to be pushed into the blocks by stage collision. And in this case, I, I don't know. I don't know, man. It's weird sometimes. <laughs> Steve! <laughs> no, stage! <laughs> True! I mean, both. Both. <laughs> I mean, both are acting as deterrents to get back to the platform. So, Just Blue going to be taking a pretty easy and quick game one as we move into game two back on Small Battlefield. All right. Now, Drilago, you know, he's had one game to search to download what Just Blue is going to do, and uh, apparently still running away with it here, this game plan. But now, finally, getting those patented Falco combos. Keeping it even. You just can't let Just Blue get these walls. And when you do, there we go. You got the reflector. And that can go through pretty easily. Yeah, you do have the forward tilt. It's really tough because Falco doesn't really have a really great way to punish Steve on the other side of a walk. Yeah, you can go for your reflector, but it's only doing like deep, like small amount of damage and it doesn't really do a lot of knockback. It's just more like lasering them and tasering them, so it's not too well. Yeah, but you know what? You have plenty of time to, you know, force the situation. Mm -hmm. And yes, the hard part is that Just Blue, as Steve, is just going to mine for Whoa. resources. Oh, but is this going to be it? It is! Not again! It's crazy, because Just Blue looked like he was actually going to lose that stock, potentially to a, da uh, Fal a Falco down air, but Jolago actually getting hit instead and getting pushed off stage, where Just Blue is just going to get the checkmate with the block set up. But now Jolago able to get a sweet down tilt and getting a KO here. Okay. Trying to mix up his recovery landing on the stage, but you know what? He gets 54% uh, for all of his trouble. Is he going to be able to make it back? Oh my Ooh. god! Yeah, Drilago. the bird away. Drilago ended up using the jump, just trying to get enough height to get back onto the platform, but ends up actually getting hit by the spike again from Just Blue. All right, great reflector. Getting that minecart out of the way as well. And Just Blue is just hanging around. Good damage, nice consecutive up airs just to get some damage in. Let's see if Drilago is able to push up any momentum further, but Just Blue is going to be it capitalizing with these up airs. Okay, nope, we're recovering high. I don't think the wall really put him in a bad position, Ooh. but not a great one either. Set up the TNT block, Ooh. actually catches the air dodge with the up smash. Great uh, option coverage. Okay, stand on that anvil. What do we see? The drag down into maybe the forward air? Okay. Yeah, great damage. 105%. Now Just Blue is in range of smash attacks and potentially a nice sweet spot back air. Not again! Oh, that is not what you want to see. Definitely caught up maybe potential uh, air dodge, but Drilago actually ended up going for the uh, air dodge down, which landed right into the lava block. Yeah, just I think Drilago was just expecting him to like follow up with these combos. That was such so heartbreaking right there. Mm -hmm. And before we were, obviously we can't go back, but it was actually up special interacted with Falco and knocked him on the platform and down. So that's why he actually lost his first stock to the, the mm. platform blocks that we saw Just Blue set up. That's right. We're going back to Small Battlefield. I don't know why we're going back to the same stage. It's, like, you've lost twice. Maybe changing the stage is not a bad idea. I don't, I mean, what stage could you honestly benefit from at this point other than Small Battlefield? Like, Battle you kind of want like a smaller stage, but you also don't want it to be too small. But you don't want to give so much room for Just Blue. Yeah, but I think even like just the mental change, right? Like yeah. The change of scenery. At uh -oh. least game two is better than game one, so yes. maybe you can take that into effect too. So Drilago over here, just trying not to take too much damage here. It's okay. Uh, versus Steve, you're going to take about 60 damage. It's fine. After that, you're just chilling. But we do have finally these stone tools. Running away, oh. down air misses. Yeah, these up airs have been connecting, but they really haven't been doing too much in terms of getting the additional damage in. Or, or mid percents. Yeah. And it's not really setting up for a kill here either. Yeah. I mean, it's tough at those mid percents because you're really transitioning into higher percents. You're, it's really hard for Falcon unless you're like... Uh, oh, the back air. That, that wasn't even diamond. Uh, setting up the, the two towers in between the platforms, so it's really hard to actually try to get in. And Steve is the eye of Sauron? Yes, pretty much. <laughs> Sees everything. The Drilago getting all those combos. Still 128. Just Blue ain't going down without a fight. Mm, great down tilt. Just forcing Just Blue to recover from high. And I would walk 1,000 miles. Oh, great and I patience. Would combo 1,000 more. That should be. Oh, I was about to say that might have been a kill for Just Blue, but I guess I was wrong. Nice forward air. Pushing uh, Just Blue off stage once more, but Drilago is still trying to hunt for a kill in this first stock. Yeah, Just Blue maybe just swinging a little too early here. Okay. 
still nothing. Yeah, it's stale from the other usages, but we are going to be getting the rising Nair on Falco, so he's able to finally get a stock. But you know what's worse? You see a Steve with Diamond coming off the Angel platform. Oh, boy. All right, right now. Oh, wow. that's not grab. Okay, here we go. All right, get away from that anvil. We ain't about those Looney Tunes here. Yeah, you got to be really careful of a, a pickaxe forward air at this point. Just like that. Not okay. from center stage, though. We did see the kill spark, but great DI from Trilago. Uh -oh. Okay, yeah. The little dash attack. It's going to be fine. Oh. Okay, we got the lasers. Ooh, that was a dangerous footstool. And he's still trying oh. to challenge that. All right, but footstool. Yeah, Just Blue, Just Blue has that tech where you can't go for, for a footstool out of shield into the anvil setup, which is definitely a guaranteed kill confirm at those higher percents. All right, what? You're still above Steve? Not really where you want to be. Oh, above absolutely. and below, it's the most dangerous place. Yeah, absolutely. You always got to be careful. Even on Steve, like you cannot be having Falco right below you. It's not a good idea. Those up tilts are going to be sending you into that back air from center stage, but just missing out on the kill because you were center stage. Oh my god, the minecart actually saving his life. Shocking. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, I've never seen that before. <laughs> oh, right. that was a drag down uh, neutral air into the down tilt, but just misses out. Mm -hmm. All right, oh. we stole a diamond again, but you know what? Just need hands. Oh my god, okay. Oh, great. There, it was the up... Tilt was actually scaled so much you could get the up smash out of shield, so great utilization of that. But watch out, you've just taken almost 60% oh, in the alive. small interactions. He's dead! Yes, now he's dead with that forward smash on the diamond. Sword, that is going to be a just blue. I'd say a pretty convincing 3-0 if I were to say so myself. It was. Drilago really has got... Ah, oh, he's shaking his head. I understand the frustration. He was starting to figure it out. I think that last game was the best one of the set so far. Yeah, it's it's tough. Cause it's, you know, Just Blue has been Massachusetts PR, especially highly, I think top five a few times, and New England PR. In, in a region that's so stacked, you have, you have Mars, you have Light, obviously, you know, top ten player in the world. You have local killers like Nido Sharp, and now Leviathan, you have Just Blue, you have Brujo, you have Antimony, you have Apple Reviewer, who was actually in Tri-State for a while, now back in Tri-State for a bit. He did really well at Maxwell's too, so... Yeah, Apple our, Reviewer our, is really cool. You know, I, I was like really curious, I'm like, are the legends true? And I brought an Apple. Uh, Apple I'm, I'm like, what kind of Apple is Oh, this? did you actually do it? He's like, Fiji. I'm like, oh. He knows. <laughs> he knows. He, he, will, he will grab the Apple, he will yeah. inspect it, and he's like, this is blank. And yeah. he just... And he'll dissect it, and he has, like, have you seen the spreadsheet? No, no. You, he can tell me anything, and I would believe him. Yeah, no, no, no. So he, I'm pretty sure you can look at his Twitter, and uh -huh. there's a spreadsheet of all the apples he's ever seen, and he has, like, reviews on it, and, like, sometimes he'll post on his Twitter, like, oh, yes, this apple, it is elegant in taste, it has a nice tart to it, 2.8 out of 10. And it, <laughs> 2.8? I, I, I don't know. What's the 10 out of 10 apple? I don't know. I, there is a, I forget what the name of his favorite apple was. I was talking to him. And Max Rez, and he mentioned it. I'm just like, ah, it's, it's right there, but I don't remember. It's okay. I will go check out his fan. Twitter. You're not a fake fan. It's yeah. all right. You can't remember everything. He I has to remember the apples. I you love, do not. I love watching Apple Review. That Me Brawler is sick. It really is. I mean, he makes him look top tier, and I wouldn't be surprised if